Beets are a great source of fiber and potassium, but did you know that the leaves are also edible and good for you? Beets come in a variety of colors and have many health benefits. Antioxidants is directly related to color. So when you have a dark purple beet, boy, you're getting some beneficial antioxidants. The beets grown here are part of the box program offered at Karen's Farm. I could also connect with people who are directly eating the produce. As a farmer, that's really rewarding to hear and see what people are, are doing and creating with the, the products that we deliver to them. We're in Longo's Kitchen tonight with Marilyn Smith and we are cooking with beets. I gotta yes. be honest, not my favorite, but you say incredibly healthy. They're so good for you and a lot of people don't like beets and Brussels sprouts, but I'm here to maybe change your okay, mind. Okay, that's what I'm hoping. I hope so. Okay. <laughs> so I see goat cheese, so I think you've changed you're it. You're in. Okay. You want to trim off the top and trim off the bottom. You can store these in the fridge in a plastic bag for up to like three months. But for this particular recipe, which is out of my book, Healthy Starts Here, um, I'm going to put them in some tin foil and then I'm going to put them on the barbecue because it's summertime and I don't want to heat my house up. How great. And then when they're cooked, it takes about, you know, because size matters, so these are little ones, so okay. they can take about 30 minutes. And then we're going to peel them. And oh, while I'm you're peeling them, me. you're you going to make okay. you're going to make the salad dressing. Oh, I so sure make, am. Whisk that up, okay? Okay. So, so in goes balsamic vinegar, some and oil, extra virgin olive oil, or yes, cold pressed canola, and then some uh, shallots. shallots, and some Dijon mustard, yes, and some honey. And while you're doing that, just look at see how this just rolls right off once they're once they're roasted. Oh, beautiful. Okay, very okay. easy. And then you're going to slice that. You're See, beets that look difficult up. to me. When I look at a beet, I think that's a lot of work. No, it's not. You know what? Because it's the oven or the grill that's cooking it, not you. This so is not nice. good. It's nice and thick. And then you're going to pour that most of it over top of the arugula. Most of it. Just uh, like leave some of it. Don't do the whole okay, thing. Okay, Missy. And then okay. it's going to look like you're going to toss that up. But yes. then I'm going to bring this over behind you. Here you go. Voila, let me serve you. Okay, and, and don't so, forget the goat cheese. Don't forget the goat See, cheese. See, this is the only reason I'm eating this Okay, beet. now eat that beet. Okay. And so you're going to drizzle in that little oh, bit of arugula. Geez, there's okay. A lot oh, there's on. a lot going on okay, there. Okay, take okay. some. Good luck. I'll talk, you eat. <laughs> We're at a time. I know it's good. <laughs> it's going to eat Have it. Have a great weekend. Eat it. Mmm. <laughs> mmm. 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 Mmm.